as long as you have fun and enjoy it, like it don't really fucking matter, does it? So. No, man, I hope he goes all right. No revolver ammo. But what if I don't want any pills? Okay. Ow, you fucking birds. Ah, oh, you dicks. No sounds. Oh shit, I haven't turned the sound alerts on. I am sorry, Mackie. I'm sorry. Mackie, forgive, forgive. He got it, he got it. We will pause this epic fight to ensure that Mackie can give me a fright. Yeah, I wondered why no one had used any. <laughs> yes, because I hadn't fucking turned them on. Sorry. Thanks for turning those on. No worries. It sounds like my husband. God damn. Come on. Get down here, you little fox. Ah, fuck. A staff of thank you for the resub. Damn, getting close to a year. Oh, Ooh, hello, big butt. Hey, hello, big butt. Yeah, you are, man. It's mad to think. It feels like it's been longer than a year with you as Statha. Like, honestly. Say, <laughs> like, that on Tuesday. Fuck off. Hello, you fuck it. Hello, you fuck it. Oh! If we sub, we get a lick. I mean, if you want one, then we can arrange that. Uh. Yeah, Dixper's uh, bossed, Liam. I tried to open the program and it kept throwing an error code at me. So I've got to have a have a look at it. I don't know what's wrong with it. It just said, like, uh, error code 1155. 
Licks for free. <laughs> the diaper. Oh! No, no. Ooh, ow, you fuck! Yeah, unfortunately, Liam, tonight it's just going to be uh, sound alerts. If I, and that is as and when I remember to turn them fucking on. But um, yeah, no dicks for tonight, just for the sheer fact it doesn't work. Emil made Tom do it. Oh my. Is that Barry or is that. Yeah, it's Barry. Alright, hopefully this is fucking open. I am a chunky boy. Can you open this gate? You love it. Maybe. Barry. <laughs> Double O six that is how it is. Uh I'll find it, don't worry about it. God fucking damn it, Barry. Oh, fucking Barry. Hurry up, Barry. Okay. Chunky bros. You ain't that big, boy. Don't come at me like that. Cat Chunk is a fucking delish. See you in a sec, Adam. Ow. Ow. <laughs> what did you take the cut out? You're now leaving Bright Falls. Come back soon, sign. We're going to the Anderson farm. I knew you were gonna say something like that. You know what? You owe me big time for this. When this is through, if we make it, I don't care what anybody says, I'm done with darkness. You're gonna buy me a tanning bed as a gift, and I'm gonna live in it. <laughs> oh, bless you. Barry's good. He's a good boy. Minecraft chunks. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. It's <laughs> got odd. Quick. <laughs> oh, you got that right, Al. You're barking mad. You are by far the craziest. But maybe that's inevitable when you deal with crazy stuff like this. It helps. This is happening, Barry. Alice, they never had Alice. She's trapped in the darkness at the bottom of the lake, but she's not dead. Ow. How can you know that? I know, Barry. I can. How? I know. Listen, I can bring her back. I can find her. There's something special about this place. The lake, it, it does something to the works of art created here. It makes them come true. But there's a catch. The dark presence, whatever that thing is, twists it to its own ends. That's why okay. all of this is happening. It's using my manuscript to take over everything. Ow, I, I see you, Rage. It happened to Thomas Zane before. It happened to the Andersons. I believe you. Crazy or not, you're not delusional. Weird shit's going down. That's a fact. I'm on board, man. I'm with you. The Andersons knew about it, but they were too far gone to tell me with all the drugs they were on. But they wrote it down. There's a message somewhere at their farm, Barry. Flammable. just need to find it. Look out! Okay. <laughs> God damn it, I'll talk to me. 
tickle my pickle. Ooh ah. Ooh ah. I lost my gun. Yeah. In crash. Wait. Uh, lost the flashlight as well. Cut out, man. Some bushes didn't get a scratch. There's no way you can climb down, though. It's like a sheer wall. Uh, help! There's something moving down here. Barry, it's a take it. Shoot the player, Barry. Nice. Barry, are you all right? <laughs> Flamacoodle. Mm. That one's worse than the first one. Good look, Bass. If I didn't catch up with Barry. <sighs> Honestly, though, Rage, sometimes the funniest moments come when you're not even trying to be fucking funny. Like, legit. Like, I remember one single handedly, the funniest moments in, like, Dungeons and Dragons I've ever been a part of was when. I was trying to be serious in character. Said something silly, but very serious because it was what she felt and meant, but come across so fucking dumb. Like, it's gone down in infamy as, like, one of the best fucking funny moments. Despite trying to be wholly serious. No, um... Ow. What it was, there was a... A darkness leviathan in the water and I was trying to recall if I'd um, remembered anything like it and the creatures we'd see I'd known about and seen were worms in the wasteland and then I, I'm looking over and bear in mind big barbarian Ivanka with Russian accent goes I've seen creatures like this before but they're worms this is not a worm this is a fish and the reaction of your DM crying because all I said was, this is not a worm, it is a fish, was fucking dumb. <laughs> like, I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Me without a weapon, <sighs> but I had no choice. Flashlight. Trust no one in the dark. It's a, it's a good analogy for life, let alone just this game. Either Dan's gaslight no sorry, it was Clarissa. Ah. Or maybe it was another divine caster that you guys have met that just maybe like um what's the spell? Alter self. Alter self could have done it. Give themselves hooves. Could have been a druid. Could have been an animal. I'm suspicious. Eh, it's not that bad. Come on. Come on! No! You fuck! You fuck! No! No fucking way! Are we gonna deal with you? Ah, fuck! <laughs> Thank you, Ashley, for <laughs> posting the Discord. And nobody knows if they're Ooh, that is nasty, nasty, no! What the fuck, you? Fuck you, dude. Hey, fine, I won't have the respawn point. Fuck! Leave him the fuck alone. Why are you running? Why are you running? Fuck! That's why I'm running, you fuck! That is. 
why I'm running. <laughs> uh, next time we'll meet a tabaxi pyromancer. Why would that be memeing on you guys if you met a tabaxi pyromancer? Just, just asking for a friend. Arka? Was driving away uh, yeah, 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 I can see. Direction as I was. For all I knew, it was Barry, caught in the consequences of leaping before looking. Because, yeah, because Tabaxi, um, Leonin, Pyromancer, uh, Wildfire Druid, yeah, 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 no, it makes sense, it's fair, that's fair. I'll let you have that one. I'm trying to deliver each page to the right time and place. I'm trying to show you how the story goes. I had seen glimpses of the life of I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. Yeah. Oh! Ooh. I could see the car, but there was no sight of the driver. Anybody here? I'm surprised this gave me. Barry! No! Danny! You're not! Please! What are you? No! No! I'm sorry! No. Um. I know you. You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again for the moonshine, you know? It makes you see. They're, they're not going to miss it. They're in the loony bin. My buddy, Danny. I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Like a real bad follow-up to a real good movie. The best friend's something bad guy who, who wrote this crap anyway. I can't shoot him. That's a shame. Oh, this door's now. I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. Huh? I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to take Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as Ooh. Yay. I was going to say, I was going to assume there's going to be collectibles in here, because otherwise, what would be the point? Uh, so we've got flag on, flashbangs, flag on ammo. Nice, nice, nice. I could hear heavy breathing, though. I swear I could hear heavy breathing, then. Fucking time. I'm assuming I can try this.